Hi, welcome to Ski Talk, brought to you by skis.com. I'm Kevin. Today I'm joined by Nordica representative John Kirkhoff. Thanks for being here, John. Yeah, I appreciate it, Kevin. Very We're much. going to give you a quick rundown of a line of boots that's been in Nordica's uh, repertoire for quite a while now, the Cruise Series for Women. Absolutely. Um, John, this is really designed for that comfort-oriented skier that's looking <laughs> yeah. for a good on-hill experience to, you know, just kind of progress to that next level, but comfort is at the top of mind, right? Yeah, when we go out and do our studies and talk to this class of skier, her first thing is, hey, I need to be comfortable and I need to be secure and I need to have those creature comforts built into the boot. Mm -hmm. So the first thing we incorporated in this you know, four buckle design was 104 millimeter last, which means the boot internally on average is 104 millimeters wide. So it's like your favorite pair of slippers you have tucked under the bed, it just wraps your foot. But with Nordica's you know, proven design and the shaft of the boot, it also gives her the right control to it. And um, to kind of go with that package of the secure fit, you keep with the classic four buckle design, yeah. but you really get upgraded level of buckles here with a four yeah. buckles that are micro adjustable and they're all aluminum. Yep, yeah, it's an easy place to cheat, you know, value out of a boot. Sure. Nordica went just the opposite direction. You know what? This is the person that we are impassioned about because they need to fall in love with skiing. Mm -hmm. This is the person who, frankly, you know, skiing's not their first, you know, priority in life, unfortunately. And so with here, we actually put in ergonomic buckles that are really easy to handle, even with a mitten, all finely tunable, you know, regardless of leg shape, if she's got a very small or larger lower leg shape, we can tune it through the different buckle adjustments. We've got a macro buckle up top that allows for a lot of adjustment. Yeah. And then to kind of coincide with that, to get that really good fit, we've got the ACP cup, right? Yeah, the cup. adjustable cuff profile is something we incorporated in it. First, we're really going after comfort here, mm -hmm. allowing this uh, rear scope to actually adjust either smaller or larger to the shape of her leg. And as a byproduct, we realize it's actually a huge performance adjustment too. If someone has a you know a longer, leaner leg and she needs more forward inclination, no problem. We just crank this thing down. Whereas if she's got a shorter, larger leg shape, we can open it up. It allows her to not only be more comfortable but stand in the right position. Okay. You know, if you're cranked forward on your ski boots and you're not a hardcore skier, it is the worst position to be in. Your legs are just getting yeah. absolutely, you know, thrashed. And so by opening it up, it allows her comfort and control and performance all in the same. Nice. Um, Warmth is a big issue for a lot of women. You yeah. guys take care of that with the extra warm liner. Yep. You know, we do um, fully heat moldable liners throughout. You've got the fit strip to make it easy to get into, but you'll see right there that extra warmth tag. Um, again, you know, for women, we looked at circulation issues, mm -hmm. and what we actually did is created a closed cell foam that we incorporate, kind of like an extra sock almost, that actually deflects the cold and retains the heat closer to her foot throughout the day. So they having to go in every 60 minutes or 90 minutes, she's out there probably, you know, you're begging her to go in for a little uh, <laughs> hot cocoa break, and she's like, oh no, I'm all good, I'm making it all the way to lunch. So Nordica really, you know, pulled out all the stops between that 104 last, the adjustable cuff, the nice features, and then an extra warm heat mold the liner. She's skiing all day long. For sure. And this boot's definitely comfort orientated, but we want to help this level of skier progress to the next level yeah. and that we've got NFS, right? Yep, there's actually two things we did there. Um, balance, stance. You jump on a pair of skis and you automatically feel a little awkward. Let's call a spade a spade, standing with your feet, you mm -hmm. know, strapped together. So we actually incorporated a little bit of an abducted stance to give her more balance on her skis, to feel more natural. It also takes less effort to get into the turn. The second thing we did is we actually elevated the flex resistance to these boots. Okay. So, you know, typically you'd see a midline boot, you know, under that $300 mark at a 50 or a 60 flex. We actually added points on. So we've got the crew 75, 65, and 55, okay. which, you know, obviously we're just adding more energy, For more sure. performance as you go up. In addition, then you get better features, better liners. Mm -hmm. So yeah, natural foot stance with an elevated flex gives her all the performance she needs in this level of boot. Nice, ladies. So if you're a recreational female skier out there, we've got three great boots for you in the cruise line. So find the one that suits you best. I'm Kevin, this is John. Thanks for joining us today on Ski Talk, brought to you by skis.com.